the Station 19 series finale features a flash forward and fierce flames. This is our summary. Never before has a wildfire burned so out of control as it did in Thursday's Station 19 series finale. The devastation from Shonda Rhimes' Grey's Anatomy Seattle spin-off is so strong that it reaches the main cast of the show. The overburdened personnel of Grey plus Sloan Memorial Hospital tends to the wounded in the ultimate crossover during Grey's season 20 finale, which premiered concurrently with 19. The deadly fire, which started in the May 23rd episode, puts the beloved Station 19 firefighting team in jeopardy and has the potential to spread throughout Seattle. A baby is born in a car amidst the chaos, firefighters are forced to seek extreme tarp shelter from the consuming flames, and there is a fierce fire tornado. About the finale blowout, executive producer and writer Zone Clack says, We wanted to use every last cent. The climax, however, also shows a bright future in which everyone escapes the carnage and finds their own happy ending, even as they all face death. Our goal was to achieve satisfaction, says Clack. We showed what they are fighting for and living for while they are in danger by using the flash forwards. What will motivate them to press forward and not give up? The action and the climax swiftly shifted to Gray Sloan, where Theo Ruiz, an injured firefighter, is brought in on a gurney and taken to an emergency room. A significant subplot of Gray's season finale revolves around Ruiz's experience in the operating room. But the hospital is experiencing a lot of crises.